Welcome back to the Big Red Barn in Round Top, Texas. This is the spring edition of 2024. And my name is Franz Helwig. And I sell American Brilliant Cut Glass at the Big Red Barn. This is our new expanded booth. If there's anything you see that you would like, please contact me. If you'd like more photos or have a question, contact me. And I'm also buying uh, co whole collections and rare rare items in cut glass. So please contact me if you or someone you know wants to sell a collection. And with that, we will begin with this 13-piece ice cream set cut in Holland by Hawks. All the pieces are signed. The blanks are brilliant and heavy. Great cutting. It's pictured in the first ACGA catalog reprint. I have 12 of the individual 7 inch plates and the entire set's only $44.95. One of my favorite trays is this marquee pattern by Jay Hoare. It's 14 inches diameter, has the little curled edge rim cut from end to end, just great quality. One of the most underrated trays, large trays that you can find and it's only $34.95. I have a bunch of little smalls here, Hawks Nut Dish, uh, oval shape, $35, really great master salt, probably by J.D. Bergen, tab handles which, with cross hatching, thick heavy blanks, $85, it's a great um, cross hatch button cane coaster, or maybe it's a lot oversized butter dip, dip holder I don't know it's $65 but I'm gonna go with coaster uh, here's a great Parisian pattern master salt by Dorflinger three and three eighths diameter it's 125 cute little butter pat probably by fry it's $35 another little butt pat uh, butter pat and it's only 10 um, here's six Russian pattern but butter pats. They're really nice. Well cut, great quality, and they're $65 a piece. Here's a set of six individual salts, oval shaped, cut and notch prisms, $45 for the whole set. A cute little card business card holder, clear button Russian pattern, probably door flinger. It's $165. And then here's a covered jam jar or mustard um, it's in block diamond by Dorflinger three and three quarter inch diameter excellent quality blank incredibly deep cut uh, really nice piece and it's 125 there's a really cute um, probably mayo bowl I don't think it's a finger bowl well I guess it could be a wine rinse or two it's cut in a, a vintage pattern grape engraving signed Libby it's only $55. It's a sugar shaker cut in a pinwheel design with crossed ellipticals. Um, it's $125. It's a two handled almond dish or butter pat. Nice cut small. I did see somewhere where they had a two handle example as a butter pat, but it's really well cut for a small. It's only $55. That's the last one I have left. Some cute oblong leaf shaped, all cut in deep miters or prisms I should say and they're 35 a piece and these are the last three out of I think I had eight it's a cute ketchup bottle um, probably Clark or Maple City triple diamond handle triple spout heavy blank 155 an oil or cruet I think this is Jay Hoare's work but I'm not positive I haven't ID'd it solid rounded handle it's $55. Bell with a pattern cut handle. Really nicely done. Um, I was thinking that this was Clark, but I, I'm starting to lean toward Fry. Uh, it's got the original Sterling clapper. Great quality. It's $6.95. I will do a show special of $4.95 on this. There's an engraved mustard jar. It has spoon, slotted lid. Floral engraving, 55. And there's a triple spout um, 
ketchup bottle. It's in Ramona by Pearpoint. Uh, triple diamond handle, original cut stopper, and it's 155. Here's a syrup pitcher. Silver plating is fading. Um, it's an egg shape, which they also did the um, little sugar shape for shakers in that egg shape. And it is 95. There's a sterling overlay cruet. It has some colored enamel enameling in it and then the hammered effect uh, overlay floral and leaf engraving and it's only 75. It's a cute little jar that I thought was Hawks but I don't see a signature. Um, really tiny engraving of flowers, uh, glass lid and it's 55. <coughs> Excuse me. I have a set of four um, apple core wines. I know I've seen the cutting and I can't remember who did it. Could be Krant Smith. Um, little double air bubbles in there. Great quality, nice cutting, lovely apple core. The set is $2.95. I have some easels. Here's a brass one for seven. And then I have various wood ones. They are plate easels, bowl easels. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, these are longer arms than the typical ones. They are five dollars a piece. <coughs> Excuse me. And then here's gift items. Um, it's a contemporary crystal decanter. It is fifteen dollars. <coughs> Lord, excuse me. Dust. Um, flute decanter with a replacement stopper, it's $10. This is a unique bowl. It, it, I want to say Tuthill, but it just doesn't seem like them. I think it was another company trying to cut copy their work. Nice floral horizontal bars, then X-cut cross-hatched areas in between, star code base. Uniquely cut half-moon mitered rim. Um, it's eight to eight and a half inches diameter, it's $95. I'll do a show special of 70. I have three um, Dorflinger flared uh, tumblers. Uh, the flare is distinctive to Dorflinger and they're in Marlboro and they are 55 each. Some acrylic stands, they have four piece. And then there's bowl and plate holders. They're acrylic. Um, they're eight dollars a piece. Medium size easels are two dollars each. Um, the large easels, which will hold up to a twelve or even a, maybe a thirteen-inch plate, are three dollars. They're the plastic ones. Have an assortment of knife rests. Pointy one, strawberry diamond. Stubby notched prisms, um, faceted knobs, and the Great Hawks number one knife rest, probably the best one in cut glass. That's 275. And here's another stubby one. It's in Belmont by Crant Smith. That's a great one too. Heavy pattern cutting, 225. I'm sorry. Notched prism is 40, and then another faceted one. I have miscellaneous books. I'm not going to go through all of them, but if, if there's a cut glass book or a glass book you're interested in, please let me know. And let's see. We'll conclude video four here um, from Round Top, Texas. And then um, stay tuned for video five.